Hello and welcome back to another vlog. As always, I have an exciting week ahead of me. Today is actually Wednesday and uh, luckily I have a day off on overtime, which means I can enjoy this beautiful summer day. As you can see behind me, the weather is really gorgeous. And I'm actually on my way to Munich city and uh, I'm meeting Angela, my friend that you saw, I think in last vlog. She's also a YouTuber. Uh, I will link her channel down below. And uh, yeah, we're going to go on a picnic in English Garden, which is actually a very quintessential like Munich thing to do. I have my backpack, I have my food, everything's ready and packed up. So let's go and start biking. I have a long way ahead of me. It's like an hour and eight minutes, 10 minutes. And since my bike is very slow, it will probably take a bit more, but uh, I'm ready to take you on this adventure with me. Thank you for watching my vlogs lately they have been blowing up a little bit more and uh, I am very very happy about that and I really appreciate each and every one of you. Let's stop blabbering and let's go and start this beautiful day. So we just split with uh, Angele and uh, we had such a lovely time. We spent like four and a half hours together just talking, eating good food and enjoying the weather. She swam. I was somehow not careful enough. I didn't take any bathing suit, which I now regret, but I know for the next time. And yeah, I had just had such a lovely day uh, with her. And uh, now I actually arrived too the city center because I actually want to film a little video for you, uh, a fashion video. I'm gonna go to Massimo Dutti which is behind me here so you know it first, it's coming eventually I think in a couple of weeks because I have a few other videos coming up first. Yeah I'm hoping that it's not gonna be too crowded because it is still middle of the week, it is uh, you know nice weather so hopefully all the people are going on the lake versus to the shops and that's why I thought it would be the perfect opportunity to film something and once I'm done here I'm gonna go bike all the way back and that will be it for today so most probably unless I do something you know super fancy or something special I will see you tomorrow it is Thursday it's the next day and uh, today is actually a public holiday in Germany which means that there is no work there is no responsibilities it's a beautiful day so I'm out on my walk but today I'm walking somewhere else because yesterday actually when I was biking back home around 15-18 minutes on bike before home it started raining full power there was like a storm a hurricane and the weather kind of went from good to bad really quickly and I really didn't want to bike in that those conditions so I left my bicycle and uh, called Xava to pick me up. So I've decided to go and pick it up. The only problem is that by foot it's more like an hour and 15 minute walk. It's like 5.5 kilometers, which is not too bad. It's definitely manageable. It's uh, considerably longer and further than what I usually do. But it's an adventure. I'm not in a rush today. So this is what I'm doing. I'm picking up my bicycle. And as you can see behind me, I'm walking through a very secluded forest. I never come here. Although I'm not complaining, I quite like it. It's nice and the trees give me some shade. It is another hot day today. So yeah, I just wanted to give you an update and hopefully my bicycle is still there today. A few moments later. And here it is. My bike is safe 
and sound and uh, yeah this saved me from the storm it saved also my bicycle it was safe and sound and now I have a journey of biking all the way back home it is Friday and uh, yesterday I didn't really give you any updates because I was all day busy with renovating or not renovating but sorting out and cleaning out my filming room and I'm really happy uh, that with the result I finally finished it but it took me all day so yeah that's why I didn't show you but I will definitely show it to you later today once I'm home but right now I have something super exciting because I am uh, in a city center, I'm in Max Vorstadt area in Munich and I'm about to meet a friend of mine, it's a new friend that I actually just recently met and we decided to meet up for after work coffee in a place where I haven't been and yeah it's a beautiful day, it's a beautiful weather and I'm really excited to meet her and get to know her a bit better as well so let me take you with me let me show you a bit the area and uh, show you how it's like So this will be the corner where I will be doing most of my videos and if you have watched my other videos and if you remember in this spot used to be like a clothing rack that is, was empty most of the time and it didn't look too good and now I took this shelf that actually had other things but I decluttered and now it's kind of like a little design piece so I have the beautiful plant over here that Xava actually got for his birthday over here I have Vogue magazine, candles and my Polaroid and this is actually a guardian little angel that I got from my mom that is supposed to give me good energy on the next shelf we have another plant reed diffuser that is supposed to make the room smell good and actually funny story with the trophy here we uh, won best dressed award at a new year's party and we actually got an award we got an oscar which is pretty funny. On the next shelf I have some of my books. This is not all my book collection but these are the ones that I thought looked kind of the best together and they were the best books that I could find. And on the lowest shelf I have my Dyson box that I also think looks quite aesthetic and now this corner is empty and honestly I love this couch. It has kind of like a grandma chic vibes and now I can stand over here and have my corner. The only thing that is missing is a picture or some decor up above the sofa and I will definitely be looking into that and trying to maybe yeah, put a little painting or something on top of there. There is a possibility of DIY. I will have to look about that but that's not super urgent. And this is going to be the angle that you will be seeing in my videos from now on. More or less I have to set it up a little bit better and check it you know better but here I can do my full length videos and you can still see my outfit all you know good and I can also do close-ups and yeah I think it's a good solution because the one room that I used to film at before I agree it is very gorgeous I love the green like kind of moss panel wall that we have unfortunately it is in front of our dining table and every time I filmed I had to basically move the whole living room apart and I had to bring things and honestly it just wasn't sustainable for me to be creating videos on a regular basis because I was just way too lazy to you know move my whole apartment around so this is going to be definitely much more sustainable this corner will stay this way and all I have to do is set up the camera and start filming uh, if you have any suggestions for the wall decor I would highly appreciate it because I'm not sure what would fit with this couch since the couch is very loud and colorful and I want it to be a bit maybe more neutral 
But like I said, I haven't really checked that out yet. So I'm always open for suggestions, any links, any of your favorites. I highly, highly appreciate it. And uh, yeah, now I'm going to enjoy my evening. We're going to go and get dinner and I will see you again tomorrow. It is Saturday and today we have no big plans except of I'm going to get my nails done. And we're going to have our quick little breakfast at Ile that we do once in a while and we really love this option because it's really close to home it is quick and easy and quite affordable so I thought I would take you with me to our little breakfast I'll show you my nail transformation but a little bit later on that it is actually raining and yeah I don't want to get wet I don't want to get the camera wet so I will not be talking a lot let me take you with me let me go and hide and yeah let's get some breakfast So I am going to my nail appointment and I just want to give you a quick before and after. As you can see the nails are really grown out. Here the polish has already come off and on the other hand I broke one nail. So my nails are really looking quite ratchet and they are in desperate need of an update. So this is the before and here is the after. I like I showed you I broke my nails so I wanted to go short and I decided to go white and elegant and simple for the summer and I absolutely love it. I think having fresh nails it's the best feeling in the world and I'm super super happy about them so yeah here they are. It is Sunday and we are on our way to uh, brunch and we are literally a few minutes away from leaving and Xava just got home from uh, Ooh, you turned the light on. He just got home from uh, yeah some work stuff he had to quickly do. And look how he came home. With flowers for me that he picked up from the field. Very cute. The cats also love it. Thank you very much. And now we have to rush. 